Okay, tonight we're going to demonstrate a little leveling up of um, of characters, how I level my mutants up, and knowing that they're a max of 1,000, this takes quite a long time to get there. Um, but these are currently, these three glubbers, one of them is my tag. Oh, that's just, that's just the dude I stuck there. Hold on. Wait, cover your wrist. Oof. They really need to rewrite this. I know I talk about this all the time, but this needs to be rewritten in HTML5, and they got to fix some of these weird bugs and stuff. But let's, uh... Let's go in here. All right, so that's my defense team because they're a thousand. I'm working on some ergons, ergan, ergan. Um, I've got my highest one up to seven twenty four. Uh, the other two are, you know, like level five hundred. So we're gonna do a couple levels just so you can see how how it works, how I do it. Uh, so my opposing team is 2976. I might have to use all three of my Glubbers on this one just to get past it. Otherwise, if I don't think it's worth fighting, I just change opponent. I just pay the money and skip it. I'll use the tag. Why not? <clears throat> Alright, I go first. The um, strategy here turn the speed up, is I'm going to fight with the spread, and I'm going to choose my tag and fight the guy that's the most threat back at me. I don't remember if this guy, I don't actually know if this guy reflects damage or not, but this guy definitely does, so I, I want to get rid of him. And also you want to consider up here, which guy's going to attack you first. You want to kind of stave off and, and bring those guys down first, and sort of calculate how many how many hits you have that that's going to take them down so i do 163 per target it's going to take three hits to get their fastest guy down so i'm gonna have to do three spreads but i'm going to take down their ergan and then we'll see what we have he's gone so the next up i can do a single attack and wipe out their glubber but that would leave me with this guy so I'll have to do two more spreads or one. You know what? I'm just going to do one single. So he's gone. And then he's going to hit me one time. And I don't think he's going to be able to do much. And he doesn't have a defense tag. So here we go. This is going down. Of course, no points, because all three of these guys are maxed out. Twenty-three ten. Okay, so here's a case where I'm going to try and use one of my Ergans. Um, I do have an advantage of about 400 points, but there is a little bit of a skew when one guy is a lot lower. So we'll see. And I'll just use a tag on this one just to ensure the win. And uh, if you didn't know, the max level for XP of earning XP is about 500. So I'm, you know, four times that on this battle. Let's take down. It's not really going to matter. I'm just going to pick one. Toast, and then we'll do a spread on this one. Pretty weak. <clears throat> Alright, so this will be 52,000. That's max XP that you can earn. And I'm using two XP orbs, uh, level 3 on him. And then I have the other, uh, what do you call them? The perk ones. So this 
this is a little higher than mine. So we got 3,000 versus 3,286. So I might be able to win, especially since the genes. I have a, uh, I had, I have an attack that's flat on the Glover. So there's no penalty in my hit. What I don't want to see is if his are brown. So that would have brown or red. That would have a bigger advantage against Glover. So I want to take down anything that's red first if I can, which is probably going to be an Urgan. Yep, there he is. So he's got a high Glover, and he went before me. So this is going to debuff all my guys, reduce my damage. Um... Let's take this. Let's take down his Urgan. Or not. And I'm dead. I might not win this. Yeah, I'm, I'm a loss. I'm a loss. Yeah, only because his Glubber went first. That's uh, that's what caused me to lose. If I wouldn't have got the debuff on it, my hits would have counted a little bit higher, and uh, I wouldn't have lost. That's okay. It's okay to lose one. It's just heal potions and a couple of points here and there. I only lost five points on that one. And we got some lag. Back up. Yeah, we're definitely not going to win that one. Not that one. Not that one. That one for sure. So here it can run all three of my Urgens. So all three of his are gonna get a turn first. And they're probably all gonna die. Okay, that was exciting. So I got half of max. As you can see, it probably takes about two battles and you gotta have something above uh, above 250 to get two levels. I'm sorry, two battles to equal one level to go up one more. Um, this'll be pretty rewarding. I'd say it's probably in the 40,000 experience range. Should be an easy battle. And the other risk too is I have one one of my Urgans is obviously um, stronger than the other two. If that one gets taken down by a defensive tag, then that puts me at a major disadvantage too. If the other two guys don't total what his are, but I mean one of these guys is higher than all of theirs put together, so I'm not really too worried about that. Forty-five. That's good. One more battle, we can get another level. So this is the road to one thousand. I need to get at least one guy there so he can be my new tag. I don't need to heal him. A lot of a lot of times they uh, level fast enough to where you don't have to heal him. But if it gets close, eh, not even worried. Dead. He's dead. And my turn. Look at there. All right. One ninety two. 
maybe what 20 28,000 experience is it half oh no it's less than half it'll be like 20k 20k watch I don't know maybe it's a little side game I'm playing while I'm doing this All right, that one's all over. Should level a couple. Maybe these two. Not quite that guy. Oh, 12,000. Yeah, I was way off. Four ninety four, almost max. This will be a good XP score. The other thing that would be cool is if um, they let you save a, a fighting team so you didn't have to select them every time. Or maybe have two or three. You can just click team one, two, or three if you use really... There's that, that's all I would use. I would have a three Glubber team or a three Ergan team or two Glubber, one Ergan. Generally, that's what I would use most of the time. It'd be nice if I didn't have to do so much clicking to fight. So... I doubt any programmers are going to watch this, but if you are, it would be cool to do that. All right, two leveled up. So I think you kind of get the idea now. We'll browse around, see if there's any other kind of like housekeeping things to do. I know I got to do my med, my med kit things. Boom. Ouch, that hurt. He's dead. He's dead too. And that guy, he's going to get hit three times. Or once. Oh, I'm sorry. Good. That's a little bit. All right. Well, you get the idea there. So that's what I do to level my guys up. And uh, I, don't, I don't need to do this for. What else do we have? So I check here every day. I'm pretty sure I have all of these. That's the last one that just came out. I actually gone through and got all of those dudes the other two the space wars that's old i've had those for a long time um and the mutant superheroes that's an old one too i have all those guys and it, it's really just to fill in the bingos because i mean i've been playing forever and i'm still missing some like this guy i i never see him come up such a pain nebulous um and if there's one of these available in the store, it'll it'll actually outline it, and you can click it and buy it directly from the bingo card. Uh, what else do we got? Uh, daily challenge. Collect. Jeez. But, uh, yeah, that's it. So, um, you saw it. That's how I level up dudes. And, uh... I guess that's all we're going to do for tonight. So enjoy it and hope that helps. Have a good one.